These pictures are from October 12, 2019, when the country saw Honorable Prime Minister Sri Narendra Modi ji picking up plastic waste on the seashore of Mahabalipuram. Have you ever wondered why Prime Minister Modi was removing plastic waste? To understand this, just look at these figures. According to an estimate, more than 10 million tons of plastic enters the oceans through rivers and streams every year, which is responsible for more than 80% of marine litter. This plastic is not only responsible for water pollution, but due to its consumption, many species of fish, turtles and other sea creatures have reached the verge of extinction. Scientists say the part floating on the ocean surface is only 1% of the total plastic, while 99% is in the stomach of sea creatures or is hidden on the ocean floor. Obviously, now you must have understood the importance of these pictures. It was about spreading awareness regarding plastic pollution in the seas and water bodies across the globe. Now let us introduce you to the ground reality in India. Here in India too, plastic is being used on a large scale today. About 5.6 million tons of plastic waste is produced every year. According to the Central Pollution Control Board, 690 tons of plastic waste is thrown in New Delhi every day. 429 tons in Chennai, 426 tons in Kolkata and 408 tons in Mumbai. These figures are only for four metropolitan cities. If the situation of the whole country is taken into account, then we can imagine what the situation would be. It is not difficult to guess either. In fact, plastic is one of the biggest threats to the environment today. So let's know about our new challenge. Side effects of plastic. Some plastic products like bags, etc. take a long time to degrade or decompose and pollute both our soil and water. Plastic contains some toxic chemicals that enter our crops and food items through soil and water and then they harm our bodies. If plastic is consumed by animals or humans, it can affect their body, lungs and other organs. In the villages, animals inadvertently swallow plastic, after which they fall ill and this leads to their death. Plastic is not a naturally rotting or degrading product. It cannot decompose in soil or dissolve in water. Over time, this plastic breaks down into small pieces and takes the form of microplastic and then contaminates the soil and water. The process of burning plastic is even more dangerous because after burning, toxic chemicals from plastic spread in the air which can prove to be fatal. It is a fact that plastic has become a big part of our everyday life. In a situation, we have better options other than plastic like alternate for plastic use bags made of cloth jute or paper instead of plastic bags instead of plastic crockery use clay kulhar or crockery made of leaves consumption of liquids filled in plastic bottles is injurious to health too so bottles made of metal or clay are a better option while buying household items like children's toys furniture and utensils. Keep in mind that they should not be made of plastic. Give more attention to items made of wood and metal. Single use means that the plastic can be used only once and it is more dangerous for the environment. Bioplastic is a better option because bioplastic can be recycled and reused. In view of the current situation, it is very important to boycott plastic. That is why, under the Swachh Bharat mission, the government has taken many steps to stop the pollution caused by plastic. On the occasion of Independence Day, the Prime Minister gave the message of boycotting plastic from the ramparts of the Red Fort. plastic single-use plastic, here हम प्लास्टिक को विदाई देने की दिशा में 2 अक्टूबर को एक पहला मजबूत कदम उठा सकते हैं क्या ऑन द ओकेजन ऑफ द 150th एनिवर्सरी ऑफ फादर ऑफ द नेशन महात्मा गांधी द प्राइम मिनिस्टर टुक अ प्लेज टू मेक द कंट्री फ्री फ्रॉम सिंगल यूज प्लास्टिक बाय 2022 अपार्ट फ्रॉम दिस एट द ग्राउंड लेवल 
the government has taken concrete and effective steps to prevent plastic use, like Fight against plastic use The use of plastic carry bags of less than 120 microns thickness has been banned from December 2021 onwards. A complete ban has been imposed on plastic pouches used in the storage, packing or sale of gutka, tobacco and pan masala. These rules are equally applicable on all the states. 21 states and union territories have adopted stringent norms against plastic and carry bags and other plastic items are banned. Instructions have been given to boycott single-use plastic products from all the offices of the central and state governments. Commissioners of 46 cities with a population of more than 1 million, 20 state capitals and 118 cities located on the banks of Ganges have been directed to prohibit both the manufacture and the use of plastic carry bags of less than 50 microns thickness. Plastic impacts not just India but the whole world. About 60 countries around the world have put strict laws against production of plastic bags and single-use plastics. By banning single-use plastic, now our country has also been included in this list. Keeping in mind the ill effects of plastic, it is our wise and moral responsibility to boycott it. By changing our small habits, we can also drive away plastic from our lives and give a plastic-free, clean environment to our future generations. So let us also take a pledge to say no to plastic today and become a responsible citizen.